It's always important to keep up with exercise and to maintain yourself physically, but it's just as important to keep up with your mind's health along with your body's. Elements Every Day, an open house event sponsored by Care and Faith LLC took place this past Friday, opening their doors for the public to get to know the teachers a little better and to learn about some exciting new classes that are coming up very, very soon. It's an open house to invite the community and introduce them to our space, our teachers, our classes that are all geared for wellness, both physically, mentally, and overall. There are yoga classes that are geared for anyone seeking a quiet, small space. Um, because this is a mental health practice, the community space is geared for smaller, more intimate classes where the teacher can really be more connected to the student. And if there are special adaptations or needs of the student, those can be communicated easily and definitely be uh, accommodated. Most of our demographic is going through something that has to do with a fundamental shift in their life due to either a change in their status, maybe they've retired, maybe they've been diagnosed with uh, something that has changed the trajectory of their life, and we're here to accommodate everyone in a space that can rejuvenate and refuel them. We're going to be teaching a seven-week class called Memory Keepers. It's basically exercise for your brain. It's for people who want to sharpen their brain or have noticed as mild memory loss. The research has shown that if people attend to exercise, diet, nutrition, socialization, and good sleep, we won't be dealing with sleep, that um, it is showing that it's more effective or at least as effective as the new dementia medications. So I, I got very excited when I came across this class that addresses all that within one hour. And you do it for seven weeks, and um, hopefully people will continue into 14 weeks of doing these classes where within each class we address, we do 10 minutes of each of those activities. How important would you say yoga is overall to people's mental health and their well-being? The body keeps the score. What that means is that we're in all of this is interconnected. Our mental and physical health is interconnected. And a primary theme throughout the work that I do every day in the conversations that I'm in with, with my clients um, is loneliness and people feeling as if they are the only ones going through their experience, which for them they are because each person is unique. However, in the greater scope of things, uh, we're all on a journey. This is a space to come together, to move your body, channel your energy into different places through that movement, which ultimately releases a lot of the tension and the stress in the body and furthermore, you have an opportunity to re-pattern your thoughts and your body gets to feel rejuvenated by the alleviation of all that mental stress and tension. It's teachers like these that will make everyone feel welcome and will help put your body and mind on the path to success. For Civic Center TV, I'm Jake Schaff.